After the next 30 minutes, you will yourself feel that God is around you, and He is watching you. Make sure you watch the whole video and don't forget to share this message with your loved ones. Type 1111 if you are ready. God is saying to you today, My beloved child, I have heard your plea and opened the gates to bring you comfort at long last. The blessing you seek shall be bestowed upon you. Open your heart to receive this gift being sent from the heavens above. The chains of suffering shall not bind your children, nor shall pangs of hunger afflict them. I shall guard them from all tragedies and banish every illness from your home. The curses seeking to drive families apart shall be nullified under my protective wings. No spirits wishing to breed infidelity shall succeed. My divine blood now envelopes your family, shielding you from all malevolent forces. No harm shall befall those I hold dear, for I am the Almighty who keeps safe my beloved treasures, nestled in the palm of my hand. You are the apple of my eye, the jewel I watch over. None can snatch you away, for my spirit resides within you always, keeping guard. This is the deliverance for which you have so patiently waited. No longer will you cower before the enemies battering at your gates. The dreams filling your slumber shall soon spring to life. Like and share the video if you have trust in the words of the God. Subscribe to the channel if you love Jesus. I know the burdens you have shouldered alone, on endless sleepless nights when doubts assailed you, even when your heart wavered, still you persevered with steadfast devotion, and I was there through all your trials, my child. Soon, another blessing shall arrive, one you did not request, but which I bestow freely as a token of my love. But hearken to my voice, for your journey is not yet at its end. I have brought you here to gaze upon the vast frontier still left to conquer. Lift your eyes to the expanse stretching far beyond the peaks your feet now tread. A great battle awaits my bravest warriors, and you shall march with valor at the vanguard of this crusade. It brings me profound joy to know you did not hesitate when I called, but instead rose up with sword in hand, ready to charge forth in my name. Not only have you fought fiercely for your loved ones, but your passion has awakened my spirit, and so I shall rain blessings down upon you, your family, your elders, your youth, and all the little ones who shall come after. For you shall blaze a trail of courage to inspire generations to come. Yours shall be a household spoken of in reverent whispers. For where you walk, my glory and power also reside. Type 111 if you believe in Jesus, I will never forsake my beloved children. Even now, fortune smiles down on you. Rejoice! for a great miracle rushes toward you like an approaching storm. It nears, I can feel it. Can you sense it too? The stillness preceding a mighty tempest soon to be unleashed. But do not allow the corroding fangs of fear and doubt to weaken your spirit. My words here shall not return void. Fortify your soul by steeping yourself in my teachings. Stay vigilant against the forces wishing to diminish your faith. Stand tall, unbroken, for I shall have the final say, every infirmity plaguing your body. I will heal. Every financial burden, I shall lift. The ghosts of your past cannot haunt you any longer. For today, I grant you liberty. The chains that have bound you will shatter as my light and warmth flood your weary soul. 
Laughter will overflow as blessings pour down in great abundance. Such glorious splendor awaits. Oh, come and allow me to imbue every fiber of your being with my restorative powers. Fling open the gates of your heart so I might fill you with my perfect peace. For though storms may batter and assail you, still you must press on undeterred by scorn and ridicule. Type Amen in the name of Jesus, this day shall see all your efforts at last rewarded. Fortune and prosperity shall flood to you like a great tidal wave, come to carry you home. If ever doubt should threaten to invade, know that I will help guide your way if only you call out to me. Each morning, bring your hopes and dreams and lay them at my feet, and I will lead you to verdant pastures where crystal streams bubble up from deep within the earth. Their restorative waters shall renew your weary soul, even as life's heavy burdens threaten to break you, still, I infuse your limbs with strength. I ignite within you an unquenchable fire so adversity cannot extinguish your dreams. This day, hold my words close to your heart. Believe, truly believe, that no barrier is too great when forged in faith. Have I not said all things become possible for those who believe? Let me see your faith in action. Sever ties with false friends and fleeting pleasures that wish only to lead you astray. In your hour of need, it is not worldly treasures which shall save you. Forsake ephemeral comforts or risk losing yourself forevermore. Keep the promises I have made ever close, for they alone contain the path to salvation. Seek me in the quiet moments before dawn steals across the horizon. Carry the warmth of our encounters throughout your day to fortify your spirit against trials which await you. And at night, unburden yourself at my feet before sleep overtakes you. Hold fast, for a great wonder rushes toward you, my child. I can already feel the wind stirring. Type, I embrace my power, to affirm, something astonishing awaits just over the horizon, transformative blessings the likes of which you've never seen. Continue keeping the faith, my beloved, I shall provide you all that you need, so you shall not want for anything. My grace and wisdom will overflow within you if only you ask it of me. Each morning, let us meet so I might guide your steps to peaceful pastures and still waters that restore the soul. I am filling your heart with passion and resilience to face each new dawn. You shall not falter but will press on with head held high, no matter the obstacles strewn across your path. For I believe in you, my child, and today I ask the same of you, believe in my promises and claim their fulfillment as your due inheritance. Has this world not taught you that impossible exists only in the minds of those too afraid to try? You were not made to wander terrified and alone through storms that seek to destroy you. I can lead you through gale and tempest to the calm shores of salvation if only you let me take your hand. Together, we shall blaze a trail, proving no barrier built by mortal hands can contain a willing heart on fire with purpose, I will infuse your soul with such radiance all the world shall marvel at your ascent, for I am the shepherd who leaves the ninety-nine to find the lost one and you are that precious lamb I welcome home with tears of joy. My child, I weep for the dreams you let die for fear of failure, but no more. This day, I instill within you the wisdom to nourish every hidden ambition kept locked away in your heart. 
I array before you goals of such magnificence and purpose even your loved ones will marvel. For I did not intend you to cower in shadows, but to let your light blaze forth to inspire all who are exposed to its brilliance. Let my teachings permeate every cell of your mind so you need not repeat past errors. You know I would never deny you my affection, therefore, believe I wish only to transform your existence into one of bountiful blessings and vibrant purpose, devoid of suffering. Type, I'm abundant, to affirm. My child, I vow to infuse your days with radiant health, abundant prosperity, and to walk every step of this odyssey by your side. Have I not said you are most precious in my sight? Then trust, the more devoted you remain to our covenant, the greater I shall shower you with blessings. Too long have, you swallowed tears of anguish as life's cruel storm sought to destroy you, but no more, this day, I extend my hand to lift you up out of despair's midnight abyss into dawn's rosy arms. The years of pain end now, henceforth, I fill your heart with love and cloak your days in sublime peace. The shame and guilt poisoning your spirit, I now cleanse and replace with healing joy. Feel my warmth surround you, beloved one. Together, we shall embark on a bold new adventure filled with previously unattainable rewards, for I am lifting you up out of darkness. This moment, you deserve all the happiness, prosperity, and blessings I am set to bestow, for you have long endured the tempest alone, my precious child. Open your eyes to the glorious future I am creating for you. Never doubt your worthiness to receive the full outpouring of my affection. Did I not promise to always remain by your side, offering strength in moments of weakness? Then fear no evil, your life flourishes within my protective embrace. Type 777 to show your belief in Jesus. Today, I offer you unconditional absolution. Will you accept the fullness of my devotion? For see, even now, I cup my hands around the flickering flame of your battered spirit, shielding you from tempest winds seeking your destruction. Fear no evil, my beloved, no harm will befall you. Heed me now in this trying hour. The season of grief preying upon you now will not long endure. I vow one radiant dawn will soon dispel the melancholy pervading your days, when all strength abandons you and anguish drops you to your knees, still will I sustain you. Have courage and believe. I will never abandon you, not even when the weight of all your unshed tears threatens to pull you under. Then, most of all, do I lift you up and speed your faltering steps. Go on, weep away all earthly sorrow, for my light shall soon bathe your wounded heart, unleashing profound joy. In me alone will your soul find lasting peace and comfort. Should you now traverse the valley of death's black shadows, still you must not give way to crippling fear. Hold my words close as a lamp to guide your feet along perilous paths. Pay no heed to enemies hissing you will stumble and fail. My voice whispers gently to you now, be still and know I am your God. I will steady your heart when dread leaves you trembling and weak. Anxiety cannot endure under the shelter of my feathers. Peace, be still, my child. Believe, I infuse you now with formidable courage against which the battering winds of misfortune hold no sway. 
Plant your feet firmly so no tempest can sweep you away. When destruction bears down from all sides, have I not said many times no weapon forged by man can overcome a willing heart ablaze with the holy fire of devotion? Fan the flames of your faith, my beloved, soon you shall stand tall for all to see what wonders I have wrought in you, my beloved child, type 999 to manifest miracles in your life, I speak to you today directly from my throne in heaven since the beginning of time when I knit you together in your mother's womb. I have known you intimately even before you took your first breath. I saw the totality of your life's journey unfold before me. I am well aware of the trials and tribulations you would face during your time on earth. I foresaw the wounds inflicted upon your gentle spirit, the adversity that would test your resilience, and the enemies that would rise up to oppose you. But I also glimpsed the unwavering strength of your faith, the depths of your love for me, and your determination to earnestly seek my face no matter the cost. Yes, your pathway has been marked by sorrow and suffering. I have watched silently as trusted friends betrayed and used you for their own gain. I have heard the cruel lies and accusations hurled at you by those ruled by jealousy and greed. During the long nights when you cried out to me from the valley of deep shadows, imploring me to take your weariness and despair, I was there. And in those barren places where fear and hopelessness threatened to snuff out your life's breath, still I remain beside you, I tell you solemnly. There has not been a single moment from the instant of your first wailing cry to this very hour that I have not tended to you. Whether you sensed my presence or believed yourself to be alone, still I unfolded you tightly in my embrace. The wounds scoring your heart have not gone unseen by me. I know the lingering ache of rejection, abandonment, and mistrust that yet smolders there. But now, I desire to heal you completely with my love, to bathe your battered spirit with my mercy and restore your soul. The time for new beginnings has come. If you are willing, I long to saturate your entire being with my unwavering strength. I will touch your lips with my power. Silencing the destructive words that others have weaponized against you. No longer will you be shackled by the weight of past griefs, instead, you shall bear the yoke of my joy, which will infuse your heart with supernatural peace. Type, yes, if you are ready for the blessings that you are about to receive, and if you believe in Christianity, kindly show your support for our community by contributing super thanks, from $50 to $100, my precious one, you have struggled for so long to believe that you are truly loved. But I tell you earnestly that my love for you transcends all earthly understanding, it remains steadfast and unchanging even on the darkest of days when you cannot perceive my presence. You are of immense, infinite value to me. I delight in you, in the faithful rhythm of your beating heart, in the light of divinity I installed within your soul, therefore, lift up your downcast eyes to meet my loving gaze. Allow my words to erase the pain of yesterday and trust wholly in the brighter future. I am preparing a powerful miracle awaits you if only you will reach for my outstretched hand. Ask me for health, and I will bestow it. Seek provision, and I will pour abundance over your household until all lack is driven out. Knock boldly on heaven's gates for wisdom and direction, then watch as I swing them wide open before you. Yes, 
The sinister forces of darkness have contrived weapons of affliction intended to destroy you, but let your lion heart be filled with courage this day, for no weapon formed against you shall prosper so long as I shield you. Like and share the video if you have trust in the words of the God, subscribe to the channel if you love Jesus. Did I not deliver you safely through crashing waves and protect you from the snare of the fowler? Countless times have I not guided your steps past unseen traps and given you wisdom when you lack discernment. Indeed, the days ahead will require deep reservoirs of courage and uncanny perception to navigate. But I remind you that the one who fashioned the stars and commands the vast heavens fights for you. My angels heed my voice and rush to defend you, my power upholds you. Therefore, banish all doubt and discouragement from your mind, determined to move forward with steadfast purpose rooted in the confidence that I go before you to clear the way. The dark powers that oppose you shall surely scatter as dust before the wind of my spirit. And as for you, my beloved, radiant vistas of blessing await just over the horizon. As you pass through the refiner fires of suffering, you are emerging as gold purified and resilient. I will multiply the gifts and talents I have invested within you so that you may leave an inheritance of blessing for generations to come. Your hands will lack no good thing, your storehouses will overflow with abundance. The work I have called you to shall thrive and bear everlasting fruit. Yes, a grand celebration awaits all who set their love upon me. Rejoice, for this is your appointed time to blossom and thrive. But even greater than these physical blessings is the sacred inheritance I reserve in heaven for you. Shelter beneath my wings, and one day you will exchange dust and ashes for a jeweled crown. You will trade mortal weeds for robes of glory purchased by my blood. And in my house, there are many rooms where you shall dwell in my presence forevermore. For now, lift your eyes higher, my beloved, the storms of life rage on, but I remain sovereign over them all. Type 111 if you believe in Jesus, my grace is sufficient for you, my mercy endures forever. Not one of my promises shall fail, nor will my love for you ever wane. You are safe in my hands, so come to me now with hopeful expectation in your heart. Bring to me your plans and petitions, casting all your cares upon my shoulders. For I desire to bless you richly. The heavens stand ready to respond to your faith-filled prayers. Only believe, and you will see my wonders revealed, for I am your omnipotent God, and there is nothing too difficult for me. My precious child, how I long to unfold you in my embrace this hour and dry your tears. I know the overwhelming grief that torments your soul. I see the despair sweeping through the chambers of your heart, threatening to suppress the last flicker of hope's flame. Where are my promises of peace and rest for the weary? You wander silently, questioning, if I am truly loved by the Almighty One, why do affliction and adversity yet pursue me? Why is my spirit vexed on every side? When will this valley of weeping finally end? I understand the doubts plaguing your mind because I see what you cannot. Behind the shadowy veil between heaven and earth, Sinister powers contrive weapons of mass destruction against you. The rulers of darkness have conspired with wicked men, devising malicious schemes to shatter your life and destroy your destiny. Type Amen in the name of Jesus, 
even some you once called friends have betrayed you, their words cut your heart like razors, leaving wounds that struggle to heal. And yet, beloved fighter of mine, despite all these things, I tell you a profound truth this hour, not one of the dark arrows striking your armor was fashioned or released without first passing through my sovereign hands. Nothing befalls you that I do not permit according to my higher purposes. Stand firm upon this truth, for it will infuse you with courage for the battle. Yes, from my throne, I witnessed every detail of the betrayal by those you trusted. I watched the conspiracy unfold from its inception, and I allowed it because through the crucible of adversity, you are being refined as gold. What the enemies of your soul meant for evil, I am transforming for your good. Surrender the injustice and cruel wrong suffered into my capable hands, precious one. I implore you, do not take revenge or repay evil with evil, for I will not anoint such actions. Rather, forgive those who persecuted you, bless and pray for them, and leave the recompense to me. Rest assured that my justice will prevail on your behalf in due time, for now, look up, gaze into the eyes of love that watch over you so tenderly. This night of weeping, although battle rages in the valleys all around you, dwell under the shadow of my wing. There, I tenderly shield you until the break of dawn. Type, I embrace my power, to affirm, the war will not last forever, but my love for you spans the eons. Even death itself, the final enemy, shall one day be swallowed up in victory. So lift your tear-stained face to mine, allow me to embrace you, and saturate your innermost being with supernatural peace. The discordance of howling winds outside shall not trouble you, for you abide at the center of my perfect will. Here, in the sanctuary of my presence, you are safe. Tomorrow, rise renewed through the strength found in me. I will impart tonight, the battle belongs to me, but the victory already belongs to you. Wield courage like a sword, faith as your shield, and my word as a lamp to illuminate your path. Feel the rhythm of my love outpoured into your heart without measure, and remember always that I am nearer than your next breath, actively fighting for you, completely committed to your happiness and success. In me, you are my beloved treasure, and I will never forsake you. Only keep your eyes uplifted to me, I am unveiling miracles one after another, even as darkness closes in around you. The present trials are only temporary, but my rewards for you are eternal. Hope in me always, my child. I hear your quiet pleas for help in the depths of despair, when you feel your will to carry on slipping away. My spirit remains ever-present. Come to me with the faith that still flickers within, for I have much to offer one who believes in my presence. You shall find not only unconditional love but supernatural power, the power to change your circumstances. Here, cradled close to my heart, nothing can touch you, no fear, no person, no force on earth. I long to shelter you completely, to heal every wound, break every chain, wipe away every tear. I see your potential, and I have plans to prosper you, to give you a hope and a future. You deserve joy without limits, beautiful dreams, and high achievement. I will empower you to rise above every obstacle, and my perfect peace will guard your mind and heart. As you read these words, believe in me, accept my love, 
Embrace my help, for I am always your best and wisest choice. I see farther than human eyes can perceive, and wonders await you that your mind cannot yet fathom. I want to see you healthy, happy, strong, and enthusiastic to greet each new day. Let bold faith and excitement about the future fill your thoughts. Be still, do not listen to the voices of, type Amen, if you believe in God, if you're all set, type, yes, take care of yourself. Type, I claim it, if you receive this declaration, type, yes, if you're ready and share this video with five people who trust God, comment, Jesus is Lord, to support our channel. Please subscribe to our channel and turn on bell notifications, type 777, if you believe this, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you believe in God, type, I really love you God. And if you believe in Christianity, kindly show your support for our community by contributing super thanks, from $50 to $100, God bless you my child, type Amen.